Um, they're usually really young cats. Yeah. They've gotten pregnant when they're five months old. Yeah. Um, so they're freaked out on the streets, starving. They come in here and about five times this summer, I had cats come in one night and have their kittens the next morning here. I, yeah. I would like them to be born here just because sometimes you lose them. Polly. Polly. Um, sometimes you lose them and, and I'm better able to deal with that than fosters are. Because <laughs> I'm used to it, unfortunately. Okay. But yeah, they do sure go we'll to foster. You just, need a blank, you just need a bath towel and a warm corner. A and box in the a, corner, box yeah. And there's your cat. Yeah. It doesn't, it doesn't often work quite like that. It, you know. Yeah. Or the barn. Everyone thinks the cat's in the barn. And yeah. It's amazing where they're born. We've got pictures of them, you know, born in any number of things. We've gone into trap in incredibly loud um, uh, places down by the water that you have to wear earphones and helmets and stuff to go in and do the trapping because yeah. it's so loud. And these cats, you know, you figure, oh my God, they're going to be deaf when they come out of here. But, you know, they're fine. And the mother manages it. Who knows how many were born and in the first place. You know, you get yeah. the ones that are alive still. So last year you had 1,400 cats adopted out? 1,400 came in. Yeah. Um, a certain number of those... Well, I just noticed our count for this year is uh, 42 died. Um, and that's anywhere from a newborn to a litter wiped out by something that they came in with. You know, it's all sorts of different things. Um, so of the 1,400, most get adopted. The wild ones get put back. So right. I think there was 200 and something feral cats last year. Okay. Somewhere I've got the 